Hello beautiful people out there, Agile Launcher, Agilist, Chromalis, Linus, everyone who would like to change the world of work, or should I say transform the world of work. And you know, even as an ex-photographer, I still don't understand the lighting and now I'm doing like a vlog old-fashioned way uh, with uh, a cord instead of a hair, AirPods. And uh, I'm in Mexico right now in the, uh, this journey of uh, renovate you of agility business agility is going to be the spring of business agility so I have about five to six project uh, to put in through um, did an open space uh, did uh, a lot of great things happening uh, and it's a uh, all experience it's personal it's Fredo and Fredo Pro all in togetherness and uh, I'm going through some amazing thing that it's difficult and hard when you are an authentic person and when you try to show yourself to the world um, the most authentically possible you hurt yourself you hurt others and you try to cope and you try to evolve knowing thyself and knowing the fact that I just like to be a better version of myself, a better version of my trend marks such as Agile Lounge and Power Communication and Power Photography and all of this that I try to offer to the world for a betterness and a smarter way of doing things by being authentic and daring Agile. And on, the, that, on that, that note, so yes, so if you seek per perfection, you will only find deception. This is why I discover for your personal life as well as your businesses you try to build and uh, the, the, the freedom lifestyles and anything in any ways. So being in the moment, offering the quality of presence. A lot of people say, when I say, when I explain quality of presence, they say like, oh, hold on a second. We cannot be fully 100% in full attention. Well, if, if you have this mindset, if you don't aim for at least 90 or 95% of being present, putting your phone away, putting your attention into the goal of uh, a gathering, a meeting, a workshop, what have you, then you're missing the point, you're missing something. Of course, we never ask for 100%, but we could aim for 100 and 110% and you will provide something between 85 up to 95%. That will be an achievement and you should feel fulfilled. And if you feel fulfilled, you will then feel happier. Uh, and every moment. So just to recap on the Dare Real Agile podcast that I tried to build and I building with experimentation. Um, <clears throat> of course, I didn't do as I mentioned before I left Montreal uh, so much because I was concentrating to being present with the people around me and all the discovery we did on all level, mostly personal, but also professionally. Uh, but now I'm getting back slowly to the energy of calling agility, calling conscious agility, uh, putting things pragmatically to the world to serve better my clients. So that's what we're going to do uh, coming up. And for this podcast, I really, really want to do that podcast for the community, the international community of agility, to have a space, a voice for anyone who would like to talk about subject that we don't talk enough or we talk too much and we like to put it in perspective and the sense of the daring agility and, and, and putting back and prism and science into agility and especially business agility because I truly believe that agility is not a software development gig thing anymore and, and we, we have to say it. Uh, so I try to have guesses. I don't want to do it alone. So I'm calling out again for anyone in the community who would like to do it in French, uh, maybe a bit of Spanish, uh, English. So French, English mostly. And if we'd like to do it in Spanish, uh, you'll help me actually uh, interview you in Spanish. So three language for the whole community of agility with a dare real agile. So in the comment below, I put uh, uh, a link and an email where you could actually send me uh, the idea of the topic you would like to discuss. Uh, kind of your availability as well and uh, yes so I'm inviting you to dare real agile on my podcast 
coming soon for the Spring of Agility. And remember, March 25th, a Wednesday night, we'll gather together to talk about it face-to-face, -face, the best way to convey information. I love you in La Queche. Hey, oh, guys, stay, stay cool, be at peace, be well, and hope you learned something and hope we're going to share together. Ah.